And it is special indeed because I think if there's one thing everyone loves, it is chocolate cake. So we've had classic fashion from Timby, classic cars, thanks, Chad, and we've seen classic hairstyles. <laughs> and you, Michael? <gasps> classic. A classic range from Clover. Timeless taste. Made with love by Clover. Mm. Now listen, chocolate cake, it is timeless. And this recipe is an all-in-one bowl, no mixer, out of the world, delicious. It only requires five ingredients and our classic clover. In fact, it is a classic chocolate cake that we will be making for you and this is something that everyone is going to enjoy. I feel like it's foolproof and we have Chef Tando here yeah. to show us just how quick and easy it is to use five ingredients. So you've got your eggs there. Eggs, yeah. That's There's one. some eggs. Cake mix. Cake mix is ingredient number two. Ooh. Some oil. A little bit of oil, ingredient number three. Chocolate chips, you can't leave that out. You can't leave out your chocolate chips, that's ingredient number four. Add even more and we've got some classic yogurt. Okay, well we are using our Clover Classic Dairy, dairy snack. snack and with a deliciously smooth and creamy taste of Clover Classic Dairy Snack, recipes like these will still always remain timeless even though it's quick and easy to make. Here we go. Look at that, everything in one bowl. Not Literally everything, dishes. no dishes are being made here, like very few and we just mix in everything. Mm. How big of a chocolate cake fan are you? I love for chocolate. Okay. I am nothing without chocolate, oh. personally. That's how I feel. Okay. I buy chocolate cake all the time. You're like a friend of mine that always has chocolate in her house. She comes from a Swiss background, so it's, mm. it's to be expected to have chocolate. But whenever she comes and visits, she's like, do you have chocolate? I'm like, no. Okay, I don't have chocolate in my house, though. But I am always, like, chocolate cake ready. Oh, okay. So if you want to take me out and you say, let's go out for cake, there we go. You are my person. That's that's the way to your heart is to yeah. chocolate cake. Now I've noticed you added just a little bit. Just of a little water. bit of water. What yeah. consistency are you looking for when you create the perfect cake batter? A slightly pourable consistency. So you don't want it too stiff. You don't want it too runny yeah. either. But you don't want it too runny either. Mm -hmm. You want all, everything to hold nicely. You know these are great because these are ingredients that most families have in their house. And you know when the kids are maybe being a little bit niggly and you yeah. want to do an activity with them, this is something they can help you with. And because it's nice and simple. And it's easy. Yeah. I mean, for me, I don't have, you know, time to buy all the different ingredients necessary. I like not like a caker with like all the funny equipment and and the attachments. <laughs> and the attachments. So yeah, this is the consistency you're looking for. Okay. Then once that's ready, you'll pour it in your cake tin. Make sure to prepare your cake tin, otherwise. And the best way to prepare is just a little bit of butter, or you can butter, spray it, spray it parchment paper. Whatever you have in your kitchen, but please do prepare it, otherwise you will not have any cake that comes out. You will be eating it from the tin. Okay. Is this the type of cake you need to bang to make sure there's no... no. None of that? No, 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 no. There was no aeration created in the whole method. So you don't really need to bang anything up. Okay. Just... Pop this into, Pop the, this oven. into the oven. Now, this is obviously if you... We've got quite a thick um, cake tin here in terms yeah. of our cake's going to come out quite dense. We... Um, can you spread it out a little bit and make it a little bit thinner? You can. You can literally make this in any tin you have, depending on what shape you want. This is also great because once this bakes, you could cut it and you could have one of those tall cakes. A little kid cake. Yeah, and it could look fancy. Meanwhile, it was just five ingredients, girl. Oh. Well, listen, no one has to know it was only five ingredients. We do have this recipe available for you. It's available on our website, expressoshow.com. And you can also use different flavor combinations for this recipe, like adding some cherries or chopped nuts. We use chopped chips. Um, but I think, oh, I love the idea of adding some nuts to this as well. Mm. Amazing. Should we see? There's our cake, our finished product. Ooh. Now, if you've missed any of the steps on how to make this delicious five-ingredient chocolate cake, we have a quick recap for you.
made with love by Clover.